do it. Watch the yellow buoys along the lane lines. You have to bring your head up about by the time you get to the second buoy. Keep your eye on lane number five, Leon Marchand. Well, this morning, he, in the middle of this race, his foot slowed down quite a bit, which makes me think, yeah, he might have been uh, bagging it a little bit this morning, but that's what a lot of the great swimmers do. They just want to get a lane at night. And Rich, so far off of every turn, which we've had, uh, what, two? Uh, he's gone almost 15 meters. So we'll see if he can keep that up because his underwaters are spectacular. Well, Leon Marchand, and just below him, his teammate for ASU, Zalman Sarkani. Kieran Smith's split after 100 yards was 46-31 when he set the record. And Leon Marchand, 46-32, one one hundredth off the record pace set by Kieran Smith. Look at his stroke, nice, relaxed, easy. Just going side to side, great turn. Again, oh, look at those underwaters. You see right there what I was talking about, push off on your back. And look, he has gotten away from the lane line from his, from his teammate, which I think is smart. We talk about drafting all the time, Rich, and you don't want that to happen, no. even if it is a teammate. No. 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 Kieran Smith's time at the 200-yard no. mark when he set the record was 135.70. What does Marshawn match up? 15 one hundred slower. He was one one hundred slower after a hundred yards, followed by him by 15 one hundreds after 200. Yeah. Oh, you see that beautiful glide out front. He just does it so well. He does all the little things yeah. right. He just has the entire package, Amy, the genes, both his parents, Olympic swimmers for France, training, coaching, work ethic, attitude, attention to detail. He's got it all. He really does. And it's really fun to watch. It's almost like watching on the women's side, Katie Ledecky, where you know that something magical is going to happen in the water. The 300-yard split for Kieran Smith when he set the NCAA record was 226-23. Let's find out where Marshawn matches up right now. He's ahead of pace. He's ahead of pace by about four tenths of a second. Look at him now. See what is different with his stroke. He's got his turnover going a little bit more. His legs are picking up a little bit more. He's still riding very, very high in the water. Just looking so good right now. I mean, I think we're going to see a record go down tonight. Let's see how he finishes. When Karen Smith finished, his last 50 was his second fastest. circle swim a little bit so I'm not angry at it just makes it a little bit longer of a race but it doesn't matter he's going so fast and at the 400 yard mark he was seven tenths ahead of Kieran Smith's pace he keeps getting faster and faster each and every 50 it's almost like he's negative splitting this which means the second half of the race is appearing and may be faster than the first half this is only the second time he has ever swum this competitively. He wanted to do it at a dual meter. He asked to do it this year. 341-42. He is still seven tenths ahead. Now with less than 50 yards to go. Here we go. We're coming into the very last turn. He's going to have to put his head down and go. But I think he's going to get this record. Everybody get loud. 406-32, the time to beat. Can Leon Marchand set another NCAA record? Here he comes. Sean sets the record in the 500 free. Nobody in the world has ever swum this event faster than him. Wow.